two more exciting guests that we will be interviewing. We have Maya Bellardo and Sharon Sable, very talented artists, musicians, vocalists, all the above. Welcome, ladies. Welcome, Thank you. Thank welcome. You for having us. Uh, so <laughs> I have. I, know, look, yeah, look. I love. <laughs> oh, Ivan, I love it. <laughs> I had the opportunity to Google and look you guys up and I was able to listen to Maya and mm -hmm. Maya your voice mm -hmm. is mm -hmm. angelic Talk to him. Talk to him. thank you Church. angelic really beautiful Church. beautiful um, tell us a little bit about mm -hmm. who is Maya Bellardo Ooh, that sounds like a loaded question it is right <laughs> I'm just sitting here in heaven right now so uh, look, yeah. so I'm gonna get her all day long oh but. goodness um, well I'm just <clears throat> Um, I'm 23 years old. Just nice. I just love jazz. Mm -hmm. um, I fell in love with it when I was around 17 years old. I went to Cap Calloway School of the Arts, so as you know, that's yes. pretty jazz background. Mm -hmm. um, funny story, when I first, I don't know if you guys know the movie Moulin Rouge. Mm -hmm. Yes, of course. <laughs> the opening song is Nature Boy, mm -hmm. and when I heard that song, I fell in love with it. I was about, I believe, 11, 12 years old, and I fell in love with that song, and I kept playing that part over and over mm -hmm. and over again, because in my household, uh, my parents are very R&B, hip-hop, mm -hmm. 90s, mm -hmm. yeah. um, no jazz in the house. Okay. So when I heard that song, I fell in love with it, and I went on YouTube, and I found like Ella Fitzgerald, Frank Sinatra, and that's how mm. I fell in love with jazz. So right, yeah, right. <laughs> and 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 Sharon, let's let's mm -hmm. let's talk well, about. I've heard her before. I will. It's yeah. amazing. So it's amazing. who is Sharon? Sable? <laughs> well, similarly, I wasn't really exposed to jazz until I was probably about 17 or so, mm -hmm. and um, I was singing R&B and pop music okay. back in the right. 90s, and. Um, my manager at the time suggested that I listen to Sam Cooke and Billie Holiday, mm. and iconic. That was it. It was it from there. <laughs> she threw her hands up. It was, it was it from there. Now, and I still do. I still do. I popped that CD in the other day. It was it was Sam Cooke doing the Billie Holiday song book wow. that I first got, and wow. it just it changed my whole world. See, I, I love jazz music. I think jazz music is very soothing to the soul mm -hmm. and very relaxing and de-stressing as well. So mm -hmm. I, was, I grew up in a family that was very music, musically oriented and we all played instruments, we all sang. It was just something that was really, really important to our family. I'm 100% Italian, so we always come together, not just to eat, but mm -hmm. also to sing mm -hmm. and dance. And jazz music was very mm -hmm. popular in our family. So mm -hmm. I grew up listening to all styles, but specifically jazz music. And I have, a, I have a connection with it. And I love it so much. And I think it's very healthy mm -hmm. to listen to jazz music, not just for your mental state, but just for your soul. Mm -hmm. Now, could you tell our viewers a little bit about you know, how can they find out about your music, your voice? Where can they listen or Google? Why don't you let our viewers know? We'll, talk, we'll, we'll start with you, Maya. Okay, <laughs> so I'm on everything, um, Facebook, Instagram. I have two singles out, original songs. They're on all streaming platforms, um, and yeah, so that's awesome. me. <laughs> awesome, and Sharon? Uh, my website is SharonSableMusic.com. Um, I'm on Instagram, but I need to get better at it. <laughs> <laughs> Facebook under Sharon Sable, and um, I have a recording out with a full band, fantastic musicians, it's called Love Evermore. And I'm working on a recording now, which is a tribute to um, a jazz pianist and vocalist, Blossom Deary, mm -hmm. uh, a lesser known artist. But Miles Davis and Bill Evans were two of her biggest fans. And I'm really excited to, to share her music with people who might not know it yet. Wow. So, so I have a question, right? Like, one, how did you hook up with Jonathan Whitney, right? <laughs> How did you do that? Because John, Jonathan is just a, a genius, right? I, I like to say that he's Delaware's Quincy Jones, right? Mm -hmm. um, and I heard your voice, I, and I heard yours just a little bit, but two amazing voices, uh, two amazing just songstress, right? Mm -hmm. well, the second part is, who, who is your, insp your personal inspiration? So mm -hmm. Jonathan Whitney first, and who's your inspiration? So mm -hmm. first you want to know how I, we met how, Jonathan yeah, How you hooked up with Jonathan? What you got going on? Um, I well, I mean, he's in the jazz scene. As you know, he is an amazing musician mm -hmm. on his own right. Um, so I've performed with him a few times, mm -hmm. um, just known him around the circuit. So that's yeah. kind of how I met him. Yeah. Um, how about you? <laughs> I think through my husband. Mm -hmm. uh, he's a 
jazz guitarist. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. Sean Q. He goes by Q. Shout out to Sean uh, Q. Shout out to Sean Q. <laughs> um, and Jonathan was one of the first people I met when I moved here 11 years ago. Mm -hmm. And he and his wife are, are just just wonderful people. Shout out to Holly. Yeah. Uh, and I'm, I'm, when I first moved here, I just remember, you know, after meeting them, thinking, wow, th this city is amazing. It's yeah. not only are there talented people, but just good people, wonderful people. Yeah. And Jonathan is one of them, for sure. So right. I'm really happy to still be, you know, uh, getting to know him and, and more and more people all the time here. It's just, just really, it's a blessing to be here. So y'all have something y'all working on together, right? Yeah. Which which y'all working on? <laughs> Tell her, look, look at her. Look, she, look, she came out her shell. Look, when I met her years ago, she was just this quiet, just this, this innocent. Mm -hmm. Not saying she still isn't. The innocent just and she, and she was just. Oh. Wow. Now she is. Okay, so what you got? got like, what y'all got cooking? So we have a show mm -hmm. this Friday at CSC, right? Mm -hmm. Station? CSC mm -hmm. building. Mm -hmm. Building. Um, it's Station. at 7. Okay. There's, um, of course, we're, we'll be there, but there's going to be amazing, other amazing artists. Who like else? Who else? Naja, Nicole, mm -hmm. Jay Street, mm -hmm. uh, uh, Gus Mercante, a counter tenor. This is going to be a concert, uh, concert. Yeah. yeah. Darnell Miller. Oh, it's game over with that. <laughs> yes. Uh, yes. A <laughs> wonderful artist from Philadelphia, V. Shane Frederick. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, super cool. Nice. Um, Hannah Carter, mm -hmm. um, Love and Soul, I believe. And this Love is and this soul. is getting yeah. ready for um, the, the Clifford Brown, right? The, the yes. Clifford yeah. Brown. Oh God, this is going to be such. A good year. <laughs> so that's oh. on my calendar. <laughs> oh, I gosh. have not had the opportunity to attend the Clifford Brown concert <gasps> that is hosted in Wilmington. We in hosted some, it. We right. Hosted I, it. I, I re that. I remember. I saw that. I wasn't invited, but that's okay. Maybe this year you'll invite me. But no, I plan on attending because I. It's. A great turnout. Mm -hmm. Yes. Great, great turnout. It's held every summer. Yep. Mm -hmm. And yep. I believe it's scheduled yep. for June. I think it I think I remember. Is it June, John? I believe this year? Mm -hmm. I believe it is in June mm -hmm. and I plan on attending because mm -hmm. yes. I again love jazz music. My family loves jazz music. I plan on taking my parents to the event. Will the both of you be performing, maybe? Hopefully. Oh, I've performed like, in it before. Mm -hmm. So hopefully. Speaking we'll see. of performances. <laughs> oh oh, <laughs> Come on, you know what I'm going to ask for. Oh, goodness. Just, just a little bit from both of you. Just a little bit. A little? Just a little bit. Mm, okay. they're, they're looking at me like this man going, on, Ivan. It's just, early. I know. Just a little it's bit. It's early. Okay. I am Do, not just, warmed up. Just That's a okay. smidgen just then, to get people to come out. Then if, if, Sharon, if, if Sharon, if you don't, I, I'm... I'll sing it for Epic Enterprise. Okay. Do you want to sing? No, 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 no. I, I have a... My sister is a, a trained opera singer. Oh, and wow. if you're not properly warmed up, you can That's damage your vocal cords. Oh, so yes. I, okay. I didn't know that. Very, okay. very important. I get it. So she, I knows, I know. she knows. I didn't know that. I want to do all you. I will not be the bane of you not performing Friday, okay? Yes. That will not yeah, happen. So, right. <laughs> yeah, so if you don't, I'm fine with that. But you know. But if you do. <laughs> how how about too. this? Why don't we have our viewers look you up, sign in, or just show up Friday to the event so they can really okay. hear you showcase your vocal abilities? How about that? I can I like go that. with that. I, like I can that. go with yeah, that. So. Make, sure, make sure you go check them out. We'll put, we'll put a link in the description below so you can find out their music and you, and you can check them out. Um, but I'm totally excited. To, I, I'm going to try my best to get there Friday to come. Um, I think that the, anything Jonathan Whitney put on mm -hmm. like, is mm -hmm. freaking amazing. And, and, and Tina Betts, too. Yeah, Tina Betts. Tina Betts. Mm -hmm. Love her so yes. much. That's my homie. <laughs> Right. Well, well, the Clifford Brown Jazz Festival wouldn't exist if it wasn't for her. There you so, go. And, and this is the year round series called How Do You Sing Love? Wow. It's going to be very love. special. Love. So perfect. Yeah. Yep. Well, ladies, thank you so much for coming on the show. Good luck. Break a thank leg you. on Friday. And hopefully you. we'll be able to swing by. I might not be able to because I'm stuck at my restaurant. But <laughs> Ivan will try his best. So thanks again. Thank you. All right.